boats in Rust are great for many tasks. They can take you out to the ocean, where you can either farm barrels on the water surface, or you can go diving for underwater crates. You can use them to ferry loot between faraway bases, or to drive to a remote farming ground. And of course, they are essential to reach the cargo ship as well as the oil rigs. You probably already know that boats decay if they are left out in the open. However, once there is a roof over them, the decay stops. This is why people build boat bases, to keep a boat handy in case they need one urgently. When I made my first boat base in-game, I thought it would be trivial. However, my first attempts didn't turn out that well, as it's necessary to observe a few subtleties. In this quick tips episode, I'll show you how to build a small and simple boat base. I kept it cheap, so you won't have to invest too much time to build and upkeep it. It's meant to be an auxiliary base, not a main base, thus it provides only minimal protection. On the side facing the shore, it has an airlock. Behind the airlock we find the utility and spawn room. TC and main loot are behind this garage door. The workbench and the furnaces can help you to keep the base operational. Behind the other garage door we find the boat itself. You might know that the boat sits on foundation steps. This is one of the little tricks I found to make it easier to park and exit the boat. Behind this garage door, you can optionally place a locker, which you can for example use to switch from your main gear set into a diving gear set. This garage door grants the boat access to the ocean. The first step of the build is to locate a good spot for your boat base. You'll need to be able to build two foundations, one towards the coast, which is just above the water level, and one towards the water, which is a half height step lower. This usually rules out shallow water. In case you didn't know, rivers work great. You can take a boat all the way up to the source. The only issue is, the further you build the base upstream, the longer you are exposed while driving the boat back to base. Start with two raised square foundations. Don't build them too close to the water level, or you might have trouble when entering the base with the boat. Then, ensure that you can place the two lower foundations next to it. Now place three raised triangles as shown and a lower one on the water side. Upgrade this one by one first, add a door and put the TC as far back as possible to the left. I'll leave the ceiling off so you can better see what I'm building. Now upgrade the extended two by one. Place a single door to the right and a double door to the left. Add a triangle airlock in front of the single door. I'd recommend to use a window or a shop front to be able to check the surroundings before you leave the base. For the loot room, choose whichever design you prefer. I will only add four large boxes in addition to the TC. Ideally, close off the loot room with a garage door. Place a workbench into this triangle and one or two furnaces in front of it. A campfire will allow you to warm up and cook food. There should be space left for three sleeping bags. If you can afford it, replace the double door with another garage door. Next, let's work on the boat hangar. Destroy the center foundation just outside the garage door. Upgrade the remaining foundations to stone. Place a wall frame next to the main loot room. Then place full walls all around the 2x1 and the raised triangle. Match the height of the remaining walls via half walls. Close off the boat hangar with a garage door. Place foundation steps into the gap and upgrade them to stone. They will hold and stabilize the boat when you drive it onto them, making it a lot easier to enter and exit the boat. Place a garage door and then a locker into the remaining triangle. And that completes the base. The base is really simple to use. When you drive up, either switch positions or have your teammate open the outer garage door. Then drive the boat onto the foundation steps. To 
go back out, open the garage door and just reverse. If you go fast enough, you can close the garage door from the driver's seat. I hope you enjoyed this quick tips episode on boat bases. Have fun exploring Rust's ocean. Until then, Evil Wurst out. Thank you.